everybody! <laughs> so, a little bit different from where I left you yesterday, but I'm out shooting with the lovely Hannah Hi. back there. <laughs> but basically, I work at, oh shoot, I picked the pole. I work at 1.30, um, well, one really, because I was an hour late yesterday, and I really only want to get half an hour pay deducted from my wage. Not really what I came on here to talk about, but anyways. Um, so, I think I mentioned in my last vlog that I need to start just like shooting content that's not just ads and promotional content, like just lifestyle type stuff. And yeah, so I thought it would be really cool to connect with a photographer. Um, Abby, I don't know if this video had ever gone live, but I had gone on like a bus tour around Bristol. And I went with a, another blogger here named Abby, and this is one of the photographers that she uses. And I just think it's really important to like mesh and gel with your photographer. All of my photographers in the past have been my friends. So um, you already kind of have a more relaxed vibe. So that was kind of important to me to like kind of meet up with someone and not feel forced with them. So anyways, um, I've got, believe it or not, like eight different outfits to shoot in like that tiny bag that um, had the perfume in it yesterday um, but I've got like different accessories and stuff so we're gonna quickly shoot that and then we're actually going on a socialite campaign at a restaurant called Bosco and I've seen some of the campaigns that have been shot there before and they've turned out so incredibly nice so it's like I feel honored but I'm also putting my pants a little bit so anyways that's what we've got going on I'm gonna shoot something really cute and quick in front of this bus and then I think we're headed to a record store. Alrighty, so location number two <laughs> in front of the lane. Is this like um, bowling lanes, right? Yeah, yeah it's bowling. Bowling, bowling. super cute. <laughs> and then we're going over there to the record shop. So I'll be taking one outside and then um, probably inside as well. But look at this necklace that was sent to me today. How cute is that? I will have it linked in the description section down below. All right, shooting again. <laughs> um, the restaurant that we're headed to is right here. I think they're playing like the cutest music ever and I'm starving. I haven't like literally put even like a cup of water in my mouth yet. But we're gonna shoot in the stairwell right there. So let's do it because I have two more things to change. <laughs> Found myself sitting on the water again Talking about love. All right. Slight outfit adjustment. Thank you. I'm going to try and get out. It's okay. You're going to be in it. No, no, you're no, no, in no. it. I haven't you're, got my head, so I'm going to be out. You're in it now. <laughs> <laughs> but we've just got to the restaurant. I am starving. I uh, literally, yesterday at that event I went to, they only, well, I should say they only, that's bad. Cupcakes and Prosecco. And then watermelon. That's that's literally all I've had for the last two days. So um, I'm starving. Anyways, we're gonna look at the menus <laughs> and get some shots, and then I have to go to work. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. What was it? Peach. Peach pancake. Yeah. What looks like an egg? It looks like pancakes. <laughs> that's what I can only imagine. Okay, so sorry you didn't get to see this beforehand, but if you head to the blog, there'll be pictures. But look at all this. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh my gosh. If I don't wake up tomorrow and this is the end of the vlog, just know it is because I've died of stress. <laughs> so, um, my brother... I think I mentioned in yesterday's vlog that like he had said that Charlie's like my dog <laughs> has been like limping. He he thinks he jumped off the bed and dislocated his hip. And I said yesterday like to hold off on it because I was just like I think like I don't think we just like jump to the vet right away. Like sometimes dogs hurt themselves and um like they won't put their paw down and stuff. Anyways he messaged me today, he's like, I think we have to take him to the vet. So they took him to the vet and yeah, he's dislocated his hip. Um, like it was $330 that I had to pay now. And then they quoted me first at $2,500 because he has to go for surgery. And then they found another vet clinic that is going to do it for $1,300. So I want to cry. <laughs> I have cried um, 
I just feel super defeated because it's like, basically, it's like 1200 Canadian dollars, which is about eight, 900 pounds. No, maybe not 900, like 750, 800 pounds to get each of the dogs here. And I finally got paid out from my car accident, making money, going on campaigns, got a job. And like, it's just thing after thing that keeps on popping up. And I was ready to book the dogs. Oh, my brother's calling. Uh, what's gonna happen is the soonest we can book him in for surgery mm -hmm. is Tuesday, okay? Okay. At 10.30. Okay. So what needs to be done is you, we'll give you the info. You need to uh, email them that you're okay with this. Okay. To sign off on it consent at 10 30 the doctor's going to give a quote on what it's going to be and you're going to have to e-transfer 80 percent at that point in time depends if they need to keep him like longer they said okay it depends if like like his recovery time it could be a couple hundred different or something she said so it depends on how the surgery goes and how he's doing okay. after but they said they'll give like another kind of quote the day of dropping him off and then they'll just need an 80 percent deposit yeah that's and then fine yeah but they don't know if they'll have to keep him for like the, just that day or they may need to get he may need to get picked up the next day like wednesday hi charlie hi my boy yeah he looks better than this morning for sure hi charlie yeah his ears are up his ears like he's he's more his normal self yeah. are you being like a good boy Oh, Lila, you must be there. Oh, dear me. Okay. Sucks he he's in trouble or something. Yeah. Good morning, everybody. So, I'm on my way to go meet a girl named Lois. She's another, like, blogger, Instagrammer here in Bristol. I know I left things off last night with the drama of Charlie. I'll update you guys on that later, because it is insane. <laughs> oh, my gosh, you guys. Look at this. Healthiness. <laughs> so this is Lois. Say morning. <laughs> um, she's getting the matcha latte. I'm getting a chai latte. I have been on a chai latte kick lately. So, anyways, and then what was in this juice again? Um, ginger, carrot, and orange juice. Healthy. And we might get a salad. <laughs> Oh my goodness, look at that. I don't know if you have this, but whenever I order